Yako! Yako! Did you not hear me hollering? Come on! Let's go! Let's get a move on! Where is your mother? Rivka! Rivka! I know, I know, I know! We're going to be late again! Alright, we we're going now! How many times have I told you you cannot take those with you? Go! Put them up! Hurry! Can't believe how cold it is already! Okay. Let's go. Rivka! It's too cold. I need my gloves. We are never getting out of here. You're cold. You will need your gloves too. Thank you, Rabbi. <coughs> I needed that. As things are, I think I need that more and more every day. <laughs> this, this I got three days ago. <laughs> I wanted to talk to you, Rabbi. It's... Uh, say no more. I'm sorry to hear it happened, but the community responded very quickly. We have enough here for oh, all your repairs. No, I, I'm grateful for the assistance, Rabbi, but that is not why I'm here. Please. I have doubts. I don't understand. I, uh, I pray daily. I never miss shul. I am fair in my business. I live a modest life, and yet... Menachem, you are not the only one who has suffered. These are dark times. Hardships have come on us all. But with all things considered, we, we should be thankful. Here in the country, we have been left mostly to ourselves. Things could be much worse. We, we could be in one of those ghettos. So today we are not in a ghetto, but what will stop them from rounding us up tomorrow? Oh, heaven forbid. Heaven forbid such a thing. Heaven forbid? I doubt it. 
everywhere I look, everywhere I turn, I see injustice, and it's not just the political situation. Take Hiram, for instance. One of the kindest souls I have ever met. His wife dies of cancer at 34. Two years later, his 14-year-old daughter dead of the flu. Zevid. A feeble old man, robbed, beaten, suffers for two weeks dead. Then you hear about the families going missing, being rounded up. All the while, wicked men seem to have everything this world can offer. How can these things be allowed? Why is it that, that the wicked are allowed to prosper and the righteous must suffer so much? No, 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 please, sit. Sit. Divine justice. Nachum. Is everything okay? Yes, y yes, of course.
Please, go ahead, I have two portions. How did you manage that? I have two portions. Drink up. How's the arm? Better than yesterday. And the day before that. Here, there's your half. Finish it. No. It's yours, you need it as much as I do. It's your arm as it is. My arm is mending. How many more days can we hide your injury? If it is not better soon... It's getting better. I just need a few more days. So when it is better, you can repay me. Besides, I had enough sawdust soup for a lifetime. It is pretty terrible. You should pray with us, Menachem. I don't pray anymore. Not after... Not after all of this. Besides... Why are you praying so late anyways? It's an ancient prayer. It's a midnight service. It's a lament. Crying out for justice. Yes. It seems to be working well. Keep praying that prayer and you'll have us all put to death in no time. You really believe this is all a punishment? I don't believe you, maybe, But, I 
did. What more could it be but one more punishment for the sins of God's chosen people? Joshim. The sanctification of God's You're name. You're completely crazy. I do not know what all this means. But I'm sure Hashim is elevating his name in some way. Elevating his name. Elevating his name. So you are saying that our forced labor, our starvations, our torture, our beatings, our deaths, my wife's death, my son's. If you are saying that that the shooting of my wife and my son is to elevate God's name, he is not the God of which I want. Sorry if I offended you. My grandfather used to tell us stories as a child. Never made much sense, but... Spoke of Israel as a seed. The seed is carried by wild animals, tossed around by the wind, shoved into the ground where it dies in the case. But it is only through this death that this seed can come to life. Only then can it blossom into a beautiful flower. Hurt me yet, Yerasu. The horse is kind out for a gebeta. Gebeta went in this fry. Do all is here. You all but marked fry. Pass good off as the diner gebeta praying fair. Mussen wir heute Abend Bjorken Nacht? Sex! Sex, weiter laden, duschen! Willst du wirklich zahlen, dass wir unser so schon wieder nicht erfüllt haben? Schnell!
divine justice? This is a common question for the Jew of every generation, even more so in our times. From our earthly perspective, divine justice seems not to exist. Events seem to happen at random with no bearing on what a person deserves. But divine justice does indeed exist. When the wicked prosper, they are earning their reward now for the few good deeds that they have done. They will have earned their reward now and they will have no part in the world to come. In the same way, the righteous must also suffer. They suffer in this world for the few wicked deeds they may have done during this life. In this way, the righteous have paid for the few wicked deeds they have done in this life so that their reward is stored and waiting for them in the world to come. Menachem, when you see the suffering going on around you, when you see wicked prevail, when you see goodness fail, remember that our true reward is waiting for us in the world to come. This is temporary. The world to come is eternal. Rejoicing and holiness. In our short lives, we have all tried to be good men, upholding the Torah to the best of our abilities. This is our last chance to perform a mitzvah. In this world, we have nothing. We have no clothes, no belongings, and in many cases, no family. But we have Hashem. Oh, <laughs> surely, come among us in our midst today. Brothers, dance with me. Sing with me. Let us rejoice as we return our souls to God and to those who have gone before us. And we will dance and we will sing, not in this chamber, but in the chambers of heaven. This is also time left. They have taken everything away from me. The only thing that I have in my good deeds, my prayers, and my faith. 
this is the last thing that we truly own, brothers. Do not let them take this from you. This is our victory!